guy gave me a warning. He goes, you know how big this thing is? The uncle size? And I told him, oh, I'm not sure, but just bring it on. Who has the best shave ice on the island of Oahu? That is a question that's been discussed amongst the locals for a long time now. And visitors want to know who has the best shave ice and what places shall they visit. So here we are at the Matsumoto Shave Ice in North Shore. This is the most popular shave ice place on the island of Oahu. Usually there's a long line, but we're lucky and there's no line right now. But come along. No mask, no entry. So I'm gonna stick with the rainbow shave ice because that thing is really good. The Ichiban special. That's where you can add the ice cream, some condensed milk, and some of the mochi in the tray. They got all these things for tourists to buy while they're waiting. It's a trap. So you have a combination of 38 different flavors, but you can combine only three together. Doesn't mean that I can't combine condensed milk, ice cream, beans, and mochi balls with this too. Drum roll please. Now over exaggerating, but it does taste really good though. <laughs> Sweet, it's soft, it's really fluffy too. I feel like this is, it can be relaxing after you've been in the sun. I also like the fact that I feel like I'm eating ice cream along with shave ice combined. Oh my gosh. Mm. One thing they do over here, that they make sure that every little piece is filled with sweet, sugar, milk, ice cream. There is not one empty area where you feel like, hey, I think they missed a spot. No, everything is great over here. Suzuki beans and ice cream, which I added on for $1.50 more. And you have to try the shave ice with the ice cream and the Suzuki beans. It makes a really big difference. Ice cream and Suzuki beans and shave ice. But you can have some. No, I'm just joking. Which I get a, a vein to pop out of my forehead. So what you look like a caveman. It tastes damn good. <laughs> it's more practical to have it this way. I gotta say this place is amazing. I like the taste of this shave ice here. It's high quality. The price for it, you can't go wrong. The variety, how they have 38 flavors and they have different types of toppings with the ice cream, the zuki beans, the condensed milk, and even the mochi balls. The one thing I feel Matsumoto Shave Ice is special for is you get a really aloha vibe here that they really emphasize here with the locals and the tourists. It's about the aloha spirit, it's about the shave ice, and it's about combining the two. Cause that's what Hawaii is all about, right? Now we're done with the first place with Matsumoto Shave Ice. Now we're off to the second place, which is the Wyola Shave Ice located in downtown Honolulu. Is it better than Matsumoto's? I don't know, but we're gonna find out. Let's go check it out. So we're here at the Wyola Shave Ice. It's approximately a five minute drive from Ala Moana Center, and we're gonna go dive in on some shave ice now. So let's go. One thing I like about here is that I noticed that they have a variety of different shave ices. I think that's crazy. They have the mocha bowl, <laughs> a custard bowl, the sundae shave ice, the ice cream, and the zuki bowl with mochi ball. So uh, they have a lot of variety here. I've been here many times before. So let me show you what I've tried on the menu. Number one, the colorful azuki bowl with mochi balls. Number two, the delicious ice cream bowl. Number three, the creamy milkshake sundae shave ice. Number four, the unique custard bowl. You can choose an endless amount of different flavors and toppings it seems like. So this like. is the custard and the custard's on the bottom with the mochi. Uh, this has the jalapeno flavor on the shave ice so I'm gonna dive in right now. Looks amazing. 
amazing here. It has the mochi balls, the zuki beans, it has the shave ice with the blue Hawaii, and there's some ice cream on the bottom, and we'll get to that pretty soon. Over here, this is the Halpia shave ice with the mochi balls and the custards on the bottom. So I'm gonna get to the custard. They both have ice cream, they both cost $7 each with the toppings. Oh my gosh, this is so soft. It's fluffy. Oh my. It's like pure sugar heaven. I wanna cut to the chase and get to the unique part, which is the custard. I have never heard of custard shave ice before. That's why I tried it. That is heaven. <laughs> Custard is good, shave ice is good. If you would have told me that you could put the two together, I would have been like, oh, why were you doing that for? But um, I guess that's why they did it, because they discovered something new. We also have vanilla ice cream with the custard, halpia shave ice, and mochi balls. I'm gonna put this away because this other one is calling me right now with the azuki beans, the mochi ball, the blue Hawaii shave ice, and there's ice cream somewhere, but I guess I'll dive into this right now and then get to the bottom of the ice cream. Oh my gosh. The significance about the Wyola Shave Ice <laughs> is that no matter what variety you choose, they all come soft and smooth. So I just met my friend Elijah over here, and he knows all the Shave Ice spaces throughout the island since he's the fanatic. And he said that the Wyola Shave Ice is the best Shave Ice over here. Or am I wrong or? I gotta say, out of, out of all the places that I've tried, Wyola is the best. And it's funny because I used to come here so often that when I would pull up to the window, they'd be like, the usual, and I'd be like, the usual. <laughs> it's the best, hands down, the best. I gotta say, as far as variety, it's hard to beat here. I mean, you got the Sunday shave ice, the custard bowl, the mocha bowl, the zuki beans, the rain. It, it just seems pretty endless. But as far as where's the best shave ice, mm, I'm gonna have to think about it. They get back to you guys, okay? Yeah. Now, off to the final stop. Hi. Aloha. We are here at the second location, which is the Shimazu Shave Ice. This is located in Liliha, and they offer halo halo, popcorn, snacks, but we're here only for the shave ice. I'm gonna try the uncle size. I heard it's huge. Yeah, you, I think you're gonna have to kind of be strong to eat this. <laughs> I tried the other Shimazu Shave Ice located in Kapuhulu, but now we're gonna try the main one, the original. Can't wait. The thing I like about the original of this place is that it's real old school and I'm looking forward to eating shave ice the old way like how my uh, my dad them, and my grandparents have. You know the first time I went to the other Shimazu place, I was going to tell them the flavors I wanted and they stopped me because it takes them a long time to make the shave ice. Thank you very much, appreciate it. Thank you. And let me show you why it takes a longer time to make, okay? Shimazu is known for their fine shave ice texture and the huge size for the price. Look how they hand mold the shave ice precisely and carefully. I'm not sure how they do it, but it's still soft inside. Next, they add the flavors that covers the whole thing. This is the large size in the making, but even the small size is gigantic. That's pretty crazy. They don't mess around in here. Oh my god. Okay. I got it. Thank you. I appreciate it. Oh my. <laughs> so, this has three flavors. There's banana somewhere, chocolate, peanut butter cream, and coffee. Oh, uh, 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 it's too heavy. It's like it's like a dumbbell. Look, everybody's looking. Hello. The guy gave me a warning. He goes, you know how big this thing is? The uncle size? It's really the Larry or extra large size. I just call it the uncle size for fun. 
and I told him, oh, I'm not sure, but just bring it on. This is how Pia cream on the top too. I think that's the thing that makes him a little different. Now how Pia is so different. The icing on the cake and then some. Mm -hmm. I think this is heavenly. and soft. It's really rich too. <laughs> I like how the size is not compromised by just having a lot of water. There's sugar almost everywhere I'm eating. Few moments later. What do you say? I don't think I've ever been this wild by shave ice before. <laughs> the size, the dressing, how even though it's really big, there's still sugar everywhere. <laughs> oh. Yeah. <laughs> I think you have to work around it because it might tilt over and you don't want that. Tilting over because it's so tall. Even after 10 minutes in the sun, it's still not melting quick. So, and if it does, you can just have your straw right here. Ah, we really darn good. You see, it's really dense in the sugar too inside. It's still slushy. I don't think it's possible to eat this clean either. I don't care being messy. Oh. So I'm only 50% done eating this and I'm full. I think this is really good if you have it with your family and share it with your kids or so. I came here hungry and thirsty and I was only able to eat half of this. And I can eat a lot. How much sugar is inside too in the bottom? That is a whole lot. But overall, I like this place. It's not a great location if you're a tourist. I highly recommend the one on Kapahulu. Are you taking a picture? And overall, I give it a thumbs up. Price, quality, wow factor. Some honorable mentions are coconut shave ice. And I guess it's gotta be special if Obama has been here too. So if he approves, then this place gotta be good. Uncle Play's house of pure aloha. I'm gonna check it out. So I heard that this shave ice place has a very aloha feel towards it. It's very Hawaii-like. I can tell that when you walk in. And on top of that, I heard the shave ice is really good. So I gotta oh try Uncle Clay shave ice. This is definitely made with a lot of aloha. An island vintage shave ice. I heard the Mountain Magic Shave Ice is really good too, so I gotta check it out. Thank you. And the ice cream is right at the bottom, okay? Okay, thank you. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. What did you order? I ordered Tiger's Bud, Halpia, and Taro. Oh. So right now, we're here at my most favorite place in the entire world, the Jeju Bing Dessert Cafe. They have the best shave ice dessert, bingsu. I came here many times. I'm gonna go check it out. Come along. I'm excited. I'm about to eat this. Take a look at this. All this mango, whipped cream all over. They have the condensed milk. Let me try. There's a reason why this is my most favorite place in the whole entire world. It's really like fine dining over here and it's just on another level. It makes you realize that you have taste buds that you never knew that you had before. So back to my first question. Who has the best shave ice on the island of Oahu? I gotta say as far as variety, it's hard to compete with Wyola. That's the best. 
I just think that they have a wide variety without compromising quality. So if I had to be stranded on a desert island, I would want Wyola Shave Ice. We all have our opinions on what place we think has the best shave ice. So leave me a comment down below and tell me which place you think is the best and why. But that's after you follow me, a Hawaiian traveler, on Instagram that's located on the bottom below. And that's after you like and subscribe to this channel and share this video with your friends and you share it with your friends, friends, and so on. <laughs> I gotta go. Hello. Usually there's a long line, but there's no line right now, so this is perfect. I don't know what else to say. Hey, let's check it out. Uh, I'll, I'll go in and buy one.